machines like you do. Ugh. Yeah, it's pretty unorthodox. <laughs> I think she was complimenting me. He lives. Okay, we've got a grate the there we're gonna have to, to pull. Complex. Looks like it's locked off. Let me get up there. That's new. I think I can pull it open. Maybe we can get through that hatch on the ground. It looks like the one we used at the first station. There's consoles up here too! Locked. No way to get to them. You stay put. I'll see what I can find. Okay, from here, what's our play? I don't know if there is one. There has to be another way to reach those consoles. Okay, so we have a ladder up. There's batteries in the back here. Here we go. Okay, so this will make it easier to get in and out of here. Allow us to get maybe a battery. Um, Aloy, would, would you mind warning me next time you decide to uh, uh, blow up a wall? I will I'll, consider uh, it. Try. I think I can move these things. Oh, okay, here we go. There we go. Huh. There's some space back there. This should help. Maintenance bypass key? This is all of our all of our uh, ruin or relic hunting. This is really coming in hot here. Supplies. This one won't budge. Huh. Maybe one of the others. I don't think I can jump up there. I'll have to find another way. Okay. We have this key. Beautiful. I was fully expecting it to ask for a code. Yeah. If you can hop on top of it, I can get you to those consoles. Exactly. How's that? Hold it there. Let me just. I jumped on top! Hold on. That's good! Jumping over! Oh, you're going there. Okay. Made it! I'm at the console. Wait! There's data here. A, a lot. But it's blocked. Something's restricting access. If I can't get past it, my mission here is doomed. Alba, I'll help. If I can, okay? But first we have to get out of here. Right. We need to open the hatch. Okay, let's see. Oh, maybe okay. this is the one that she's gonna unlock. I'm unlocking a storage unit. There should be a power source the inside. Cell. 
Then you need to find a way into the generator room. Way ahead of you. Okay, I'm on it. On my way. <laughs> okay. We need to operate both consoles simultaneously to open the hatch. I'll get to the other console. You stay here. Ready when you are. Okay, you ready? On two. One. <laughs> Two. On two? Pumped on a psychopath? The vulnerability test scenario? Okay. That's where we need to go. Initiating biomass conversion process. What? No, 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 no. How do I shut this thing off? Oh, decimating everything. What is this? <laughs> Oops. That's how the world ended. Test complete. Adamantine restructural integrity uncompromised. What did we just see? Let's meet below. I'm gonna share a file with you, okay? Test log. Um, uh, I think it's Tuesday. The second? Who cares? I'll say this for the end of the world. It's jam-packed with irony. We developed biomass conversion here. Infinite food for infinite machines. And now we're racing against time to find something to give them indigestion. Well, it works. War machines won't be able to eat the reeds. But can we deploy them in time? God, I hope so. I don't understand. Your ancestors, they were wiped out. Your legacy didn't tell you that? The time of ashes. But most of the data about that is lost or forbidden. Oh, uh, we've got it. Well, they created machines that consumed all life. You just saw how. It's a miracle anything survived. I don't want to know this. <laughs> this is not why I'm here. I need the wisdom of my ancestors to help save my people. That's what this is. Not the knowledge of their sins. I need to find something that helps, something to bring back. The overseers will punish me. Or even worse, people will die. Do you understand? My family. My sister. I left her when she was 14. Already you could see her bones. They will starve. Alva. Alva, I get it. I do. She's just a little behind the times, you know? It's hard to explain, but you and I are working toward the same goal. And if I succeed, your people won't need any data. Things will just... They will get better. But even if I believe you, my people won't... I need to bring something back. Okay. 
Then we'll go to Test Station Ivy. And if I can find a way to kill those vines, then I will have access to the data core. What I need is in there. Yeah, and then we'll start the real mind sure blowing. If I take it, it will unblock access to all the data that this place has. And that will give you something to bring home. I'm not sure I understand. But every secret makes its own maze. A diviner <laughs> must persevere. Go on. I'll follow. Yeah. Tell yourself whatever you need to hear. We need to That's keep fine. Moving. Test station Ivy can't be far off. I was wondering if we could go explore out there. Another maze. Get used to it. The truth is never a straight line. So the metal flowers, what the data referred to as adamantine wreaths, they were supposed to stop the destruction that caused the time of ashes. Looks like it. So I never asked. Are you from around here? No, I'm not. I spent most of my life in a place far away. We've both traveled a long way. Okay, we might have actually chosen the correct path here instead of the treasure chest path. Let's find a way to get into the proving ground. Gotta be like a grapple or something, or you know, a door. A door is good. Door is fine. Another dream. Clouds perish. Darkness has no need or aid for them. She was the universe. So is this referencing Gaia, I wonder? That complex should be test station ID. Well, let's hope it holds the answers we seek. Oh yeah, cool. It's so still. Whoa! We have no oh. It's one of those machines. It's a dread wing? We're gonna have to take it out to get into the test station. Yes. Purge water. Metal fangs. Okay, hold up. We're gonna need a couple things here. Uh, rope caster. Let's go instead of berserker. Oh, okay, that might not be the case right there. Oh, he's invis.
Does it just not care about that? It may have, but probably not enough to trigger. on. Bye-bye. That was amazing. Uh, terrifying, but amazing. Well, Metal flower. Have... We should be able to get into Testation Ivy now. Okay. I mean, I would love to have blown off that piece that we wanted, but I couldn't see it, which made it a little bit more difficult. There has to be some data here on the adamantine wreath we can use. I trust your focus will see what mine cannot. Oh, that's interesting. Feeding the world. Any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic, Arthur C. Clarke. Yes. But are you are supposed to understand the trick once it's done. When the curtain pulls back to reveal the mirrors, yet I still have no idea how we achieve this act of scientific conjuring. It's not just the speed with which the projects have come together, or the stability of the results, despite the complexity of the bioengineering, it isn't even the huge variety of crops that can now be made uh, more heat, drought, and disease resistant. It's the simple fact that all these results are tangible. No announcements in scientific journals, no celebrating predictions born from simulations, our research has become manifest in physical artifacts. Where a dream took root in the abandoned industrial site four years ago, now there stands row upon row of automated FAS farming units, each of which can conduct gene manipulation in the field. The actual field. These robots analyze soil composition, light intensity, uh, temperature, wind speed, and a hundred of other factors. Then, utilizing the gene sequences we created, they can select or construct a plant to produce the best yields for that location. Of course, all the crops uh, these units create are best harvested by other FAS machines, but when a population is starving, what government is going to quibble up or quibble about being forced to use our robots to speed things up. Should I be comfortable watching Ted Farrow's coffers swell with money from the desperate and the starving? Maybe. But I know that is his belief, money, and drive that has filled the world to empty stomachs. Desperation can only be experienced by the living, and we've given them and they've given them back their lives. Us, our work. Farrow's resources, science triumphs. Together we have changed the world. Find something? The fourth test station. Willow, it looks like it's underwater. Well, good thing. Hmm. Huh. Might be worth a look sometime. I must have faith. I walk with the ancestors. This console's still operational. We shall find what we seek. Another log. work and cobble came through on a way to destroy them downloading a coded key into the deployment shell triggers an enzyme that causes the reeds to eat themselves from within but it's too late the latest projections from u.s robot command have swarm reproduction outpacing our ability to drop the shells by 375 percent. Not even close. I guess we deserve this. I deserve it for what I made here. This will be my last log before evacuation. Ooh. The regret starts to sit in. So all their efforts were in vain. They ran out of time. 
At least we have the software module they created. Oh, it should get rid of the vines cutter. produced by the metal flowers. I need a workbench to load the module into my spear. I'm gonna There's guess one it's this back way. Camp. The map showed a path leading back there past the next room. Marjane Nafishi has resigned from Marjane's letter. It's with regret that I resign. I share that regret, Marjane. You served as an excellent deputy, but no single person is above the team or project. I came to create life, not destroy it. After all we've achieved together, I did not expect such lack of vision. Yes, our research has shifted direction, but biomass conversion is no different than burning wood in a stove or distilling ethanol from molasses. It's a method to release solar energy that was captured organically. Yes, there are military applications for this technology, but that does not mean there is a logical moral argument against biomass conversion itself. To say so is emotionally petulant. Plain and simple. The saddest aspect of life right now is that science gathers knowledge faster than society gathers wisdom. There's so many of these, like, big quotes from, you know, super geniuses. For Nafisi to end her letter with a quotation made a direct attack. Childish, disappointing, personal. Any sadness I might have had about her departure left me in that moment. I wish her luck with whatever position she's able to find, but the greenhouse will continue on all the stronger now that it's free from such narrow thinking. I'll sum up with another quote, one better suited to the circumstances. Nothing in life is to be feared, is only to be understood. Now is the time to understand more so that we may fear less. Yeah, I mean, can't argue. It's a good one. In here. We'll have to climb up. Right behind you! <laughs> We can use the line to get down. Uh, <laughs> right. Easy. Yeah, it's still not easy for me sometimes. I get it. Made it. Well, there it is. A vine cutter. Holy crap. We better make haste. Now what? Now we get to that data core. As I was saying, I still can't believe you took on all these soldiers by yourself. But we'd better make haste. After we encountered barbarians, our lieutenant called for reinforcements. They could be here any time. Oh, good. Right. This new module works. Use melee attacks to open. I was blooming. Huh. Let's see if the software works. Fines. They're falling apart. Door's clear now. That's not exactly how I expected that to go down, but it is cool. Demeter, it's time to go home. To Gaia. You see the one. That's right. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Demeter's subordinate function to original code. She's not reading any of this? What did you do? I've never seen my focus glitch like that. Uh, I found a special type of data. It's something you can't read. But they kept a tight grip on the data core. But now you should have access to the central server. All of it. Should give you something to bring home. You were right. Hundreds of archives. Almost all of it relating to agriculture. It would take us years to get through all of this, but we don't have that kind of time. Uh, what you said before about- Holy. Alba, hold your fire. 
By the word of the ancestors, you must stop. Come. Look at who you fired on. That barbarian killed our soldiers! Uh, only those who fired blindly. She is no barbarian. She gave me the data we need. Come, look at her. Can't you see? Elizabeth Sobek stands before you. An ancestor reborn. Too bad she wasn't here when we first Do showed I'm... up. Could have saved some lives. We should bring the ancestor back. It is we who follow their word, Commander, not the other way around. Uh, my apologies, Dr. Sobek. Our people's faith is strong, but there are those who are not as familiar with the legacy as they should be. You heard the Diviner. The data has been found. You two, with me. The rest of you, meet us back at the beach for return to landfall. I can't talk long. They will have many questions. So do I. Your people know a lot about the past. And about Sobek, I guess, but they're... Please, I must know. What you said before about working towards the same goal? How long will it take? I don't know. A few months? Then you are my family's best hope. Let nothing get in your way. You have opened my eyes to many things, and for that, I thank you. But now you must go. Will I see you again? Soon we return to Legacy's landfall. It might be dangerous for you to go there. Well, tell me how to reach it, just in case. We made landfall on the northeast edge of the sunken city. The currents around the archipelago are vicious, and the only approach is from the south. And it is guarded. Only attempt to go there if you must. Diviner! What's the delay? Please, go. If you attempt to stay here any longer, they may want to take you with us, and that won't go well for anyone. like that it says I need to get Demeter back to Gaia anyway but I might want to head to that tall neck I saw in the forest before I make the trek back and now I can use the vine cutter on those other metal flowers I found earlier okay let's uh at least get out of here and we can take a look at things decide what we want to do So yes, there's a tall neck there. Don't know if we'll be able to override it. But I think if we have to come back out in this area, that's when we'll spend the time. So let's head right back to Gaia here. Looks like fast traveling to the base might be free all the time. I never noticed that, but... This is big. So this is the third module, which should bring her percentage, her, her power up to enough to deal with um, Hephaestus. Wouldn't surprise me if there's something else that goes wrong, but still. 